Hello there, and welcome to Crash Bandicoot Back in Time. This is a fan game by Daniel Gilchrist, or Daniel Gilchrist, I, I don't know this pronunciation of your surname, I apologise, but uh, yeah, this is a cool fan game made in Unity, and it is basically classic Crash with a level editor, and let's just dive straight in. Oh my gosh, here we are, and oh wow, it really does feel like classic Crash. That's wild. Okay, so, memory lane, let's go! Oh my gosh! This is wild. This is wild! What the hell?! <laughs> it feels like I'm playing a, cla a classic Crash game. I don't know if they plan on doing more beyond what they've got here, but... Wow. Just, just wow. I'm kind of just blown away at what we've got here. Oh my word, like, a proper, like, classic Crash fan game, like, that, I, mean, it's, I think it's just one world so far, but oh my god, it's, it's mind-blowingly cool, it's so, so cool, I don't know if I need to, yeah, no, no, we'll just do that, I was gonna say, like, I don't know if I need to do anything specific for you, but, uh, I'm not gonna, <laughs> yeah. We're going for a hundred percent full playthrough. Let's do this. The uh, I believe the level editor side of things is uh, just um, 2D levels, but I don't know if they're planning on like including a 3D level editor. I seriously hope so, because I mean, why not? Like, let people run wild with this thing if you're letting people do it because it is excellent. And there are also flashback tapes, inspired by Crash 4, obviously. Very cool, loving that. Now you may have noticed that this is version 0 0.91, uh, which means... I don't really know what that means. Uh, it will have updates because it's not 1.0. Um, but yeah, like I, I'm looking forward to seeing how it evolves over time, and I will play every single one of these versions because I'm all for the ride. Oh, that's interesting. I saw this level as a preview uh, on the YouTube video, and I think this was actually over the pit initially, so that's changed. Interesting as well, like uh, Crash 2, it doesn't tell you the box count uh, up top, uh, it, which it did afterwards. But uh, you collected an invitation to an Uka Uka trial. You can access these levels from the basement by standing in the middle of the warp room. So, I'm gonna save these for last, but I will do the first one uh, right now, just so you can see what it is. So, uh, you can see Uka Uka menacingly just here. So, I'm kind of liking the remix of this, it's pretty good. Um, so, I don't know exactly how this works. I know that Uka Uka is here. Um, so, Uka Uka can, like, hit me or something? Can I control it, or...? Oh, oh, I press X again, so it's like a- Oh, okay, that was weird. I didn't- I was expecting to break the box, and that did not happen. As you can tell. Um, okay, so yeah, this- so how it works is when Uka Uka hits you, you- Ooh, this is hard, actually. Um, you get a, like a- when you double- instead of a double jump, he attacks you, which is, is pretty neat. I like the idea. But it's harder than it looks, actually. Oh, yeah, you- that- oh, wow, okay. How often can he do the thing? I- I just sort of made the assumption that he can't do it more than once. And I don't think he can. I think it's just once until you land, which makes sense. Oh, that's super hard. That's super, super hard. It doesn't look it, but it really is. <laughs> Okay, this is so cool though. I really love this as a gimmick. Oh no. This is incredibly difficult. I bet you anything the rest of this level is going to be a cakewalk. It's just this one little section that is tripping me up. Come on, we got this. This isn't that hard. I believe. I believe. Yes, this is it. This is it. This is it. This is it. <laughs> I believe in us. Here we go. 
No! Oh my god, no! That was tragic. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh man, I was so close. I don't really know what happened. I don't know if that was a glitch or if I got really unlucky or... Oh man. I like that it's not easy. Because you could have very... Oh, what? Ah! <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's a glitch for sure. Because <laughs> Crash is supposed to just bounce off of the thing. He ain't, he ain't doing that. Yes, there we go. 1058, that seems good. What? No! Oh, you. You. Right, okay. Okay, no. I'm not gonna go for gold on all of them, but I'm going for gold on this one. I know how I can do it better. It annoys me, but I know how I can do it better. So my problem was holding my jump on these sections. Well, I don't have to. I just need to let it fall. There you go. That's it. That's it. That's more like it. Look at that. Easy. Easy as anything. Absolutely destroyed. Right, let's go back to the normal easy levels. <laughs> Ooh. Okay. So how many levels are there? They're just five. Yes. I think there's only one warp room. I don't know if I'm if it's gonna be added to have a full like 25 level warp room setup, uh, multiple warp room setup, but yeah, this is so cool. And it looked like, judging from the uh, the warp room, that it's not going to be, oh, it's super cool. It's not gonna be all like following the tradition of uh, the first warp room. Like we'll all have some uh, levels from the future warp rooms here, which is cool. Because, yeah, as you can tell, this has been mostly inspired by Crash 2. Um, whoa, okay. Um, which is my favourite, to be fair. Um, so if you're going to be inspired by any, that's a solid one to be inspired by. Can't fa fault it. Also, I'm loving these remixes. They are so good. Oh, hello. <laughs> I wasn't expecting the bird, but okay. <laughs> it's not your climate. Excellent. Oh no! <laughs> well, I made a mild mistake, but I don't know if I keep the flashback tape or not. I collected it, so in theory, yes. Is there a restart button? There is no, I mean, there's a warp room button, but not a restart per se. So interesting, okay. We will work this out together. I should probably have muted my phone, but I did not. There we go. Oh, so satisfying. The movement is not exactly the same as the original games, but it's... Whoops, I'm amazed I didn't get hit there. But it's pretty close. Like, it, it's pretty good. I think, like, making it perfectly one-to-one... -one, yeah, it's kept the flashback tape. Making it perfectly one-to-one -one would be very difficult. Also, I have noticed where the, uh, the Ukuka scroll is. Um, it, it was not super hard to find this time. Um, <laughs> but it might be later down the line. We'll see, won't we? Oh, hello. Well, it looks like the end is over there. So, yeah, short but sweet level. Oh, this is neat. But yeah, I also, I, I mentioned earlier there was a, there's a level editor in this, and, and there absolutely is. We'll, uh, we'll have a look at that at the end, I guess. Okay, didn't get that. Give me a second. There we go. There we go, lovely stuff. I don't know if uh, with the level editor you can like 
upload the levels. I don't know how sophisticated it is. I haven't really looked. I've tried not to spoil myself for this because I don't want to. You know, like, this is... It's a new Crash experience, which we are also getting an official new Crash experience uh, with Crash Team Rumble uh, in, well, actually, like, just a week uh, for the beta, which is pretty cool. Um, I presume I've got everything. I sure do. Hurrah. Nice. Lovely stuff. What level's next? That was great. Streamlining! Think I know what kind of level this is gonna be. Yeah! Oh, excellent music. Excellent music. I do love these types of levels. Hang 8 is one of my favourite levels in the entire series, to be honest. I'm an idiot. <laughs> Back to the warp room because I want that uh, that flashback tape. I will also do the flashback tapes when uh, when I've completed all the normal levels, I guess. I don't know if I'll do the Uka Uka first or mm, should I save them for last because they are clearly going to be like some of the hardest challenges. I thought that was going to get me. I was mildly scared there, but uh, no need to be. We're, we're good. Uh, scary. <laughs> like, it's not super difficult, but it's difficult enough. Oh, this is interesting. Again, not super difficult, but just scary enough, because I don't want to mess up. Well, I can see the flashback tape, which is good. Haven't seen the scroll yet. Oh, actually, I think I can see the scroll. That yellow thing in the background? Right next to the waterfall? Sad it's not a secret behind the waterfall, but can't have it all, can you? Oh no! <laughs> now, that doesn't take away the flashback tape. Excellent! I was briefly worried because I assumed the rules were the same as, you know, traditional crash, but you don't necessarily know if that's the case. Uh, but they are, so we're all good. Yeah, these feel very reminiscent of Crash 1 more than Crash 2, these bonus stages. I quite like it. Right, just need to make sure I don't screw up this jump and we'll get the tape. Oh, <laughs> nearly... In my mind, I nearly died. I don't know if I actually did or not. Oh, whoops, what I did there. Um, like, in, in my brain, it felt terrifying. We'll, uh, we'll see, won't we? That plant is evil. What the hell? <laughs> it's so ruthless. It just annihilated me twice. I had no chance against it. Right, let, let's try this again, but do it better. Yeah, that that's the way. Okay, cool. Yeah, there you go. Right, we've seen one of you before. I'm not taking chances against you. Oh, have I made a mistake? Uh, I hope not. I hope I didn't miss anything above me. Yeah, oh, what? Okay, good. Oh, the ending is the secret behind the waterfall, and then there's the scroll here. Yeah, that's clever. I like that. I might have missed that had I not seen it. Oh, that's so cool. Yeah, if I hadn't seen it in the uh, in the bonus room, I, I might have missed that. That that was really cool. All right, there we go. Silver lining. Have all of them had lining in the name? No. Okay. <laughs> I was gonna say like, wait a minute. There's <laughs> two of lining. Wait. Oh, for a second I thought it was going to be a future level from Crash 3. I was like, whoa, what? I mean, kind of blended the two together, I suppose. But, uh, different enemies. It's the enemies from Ridge Room. Interesting. Okay. Oh! All hail the mystical floating box! 
Yeah, I was gonna say, I'm gonna keep going because there's clearly gonna be a, uh, a box somewhere. And there it is. And now I have to go back. And hopefully it will go well. No! Oh, I tried to tried to slide and it did not do the slide. And that was briefly very scary. Right, so how far back do I have to go? There was this. I think it was just up here. Yeah, I think it was just these. I don't think there's anything further behind that. If there is, I don't remember it. That is scary. You barely make that. Like, it's not too difficult, but it's just scary enough, right? This is really cool. Oh, this is super cool! Okay, so where's the flashback to? I haven't seen that yet. Which is, I guess, quite scary, because that means I can't- I still can't die, and we're quite a ways into the level. That's okay. We'll get there eventually. was super cool. So was the music. I really like this music. I hope it gets released. <laughs> the, like, the remixes don't deviate too, too much, but that's a good thing. Like, it just works. Oh, this is interesting. Aha! Okay, I'm glad that was Floor. I wasn't actually certain. Oh, hello. Huh. Nearly didn't spot you. This level's awesome. This whole game is awesome. Like, it's fantastic. Like, so cool. Like, the fact that this exists. That we've got this. That's, you know. Uh, someone called Daniel was putting a lot of time and effort into making this. No! I'm an idiot. Oh, that's not good for me, though. That might make things quite difficult. I didn't actually see if, like, we could spot the end of the level from here. Because, yeah, this level's quite long. I'd say it's the longest so far. Oh, well then. <laughs> well, I like how I die. Oh, I I think I can see the level. It's in, it's in that light over there, the sparkly stuff. But I'm not 100% sure how close we are to it, to be fair. Cool. Yeah, there we go. Oh, what? No! <laughs> no! That really sucked. <laughs> like, that really, really sucked. I... I don't... I didn't deserve that death. I didn't die. I mean, I did die, but I... I shouldn't have. That was very unfortunate. So is it gonna ask me to do the bonus stage again? I guess we're about to find out. I don't know. Usually it wouldn't. But I don't know if the rules apply here. Because we- oh! Yeah, I didn't see you. Yeah, we don't know how it works in this game yet. Nope, I don't. Okay, great. That's cool. I don't know how long they've been working on this. Like, they kind of just... Like, posted like a teaser of sorts. And then they were like, okay, here's the release. <laughs> so I don't know if this is something they've been working on for ages and they've just decided to like reveal it all at once or if they've done this in like a month. <laughs> like, I have no idea which. But it's super cool! There we go. Castle Mania. Castle is in... Crash 1? Oh, the lab! Oh, wow! As I can see the scroll, sort of, through that right window, but like, I don't really know where it is. Um, oh, this is cool! Oh, what? Oh, whoops. <laughs> I'm very good at games. Yeah, this is cool. It's like a combination of lights out and the lab. Oh, man. I mean, it doesn't have, like, the lights out theme, but just, I mean, like, visually. Yeah, okay, that's good. Scary. Oh, I didn't actually know there was going to be another box there. Okay. Still... Oh, yeah. No, this is really very much a combination of lights out. Oh, 
Oh no! Oh man, this is a really tough level. Oh, I mean, I may as well warp through. I have to restart the level from the beginning anyway, so... Ooh, this is genuinely really tough. I like it a lot, but yeah, no, this is this is not easy. This is not free. I'm going to obviously try my best to get it all, but uh, I can't promise it will go well. I'm liking the axe. Okay. Oh, that's not good. Ooh! <laughs> This is a scary level. Please let the flash attack back tape be right here. Oh, of course it isn't. Why would it be? I don't trust you. Okay, great. Now we got like, slippery climb elements. Oh man, you got the best of Crash One here. That is awesome. Right, where is that flashback tape though? <laughs> oh, I got very, very lucky. Yeah, I'm just gonna let that get him. Cool. Can't see the flashback tape here. That's okay though. What I did see was a uh, Aku Aku. Great. Okay, cool. I'm gonna say, as long as I get that, I'm winning. <laughs> Uh, I hope I just fall down. Okay. <laughs> I wasn't 100% sure. Maybe add some Wumper Fruit if you ever watch this, just so the player knows for sure that there's something. Okay, right. This is where the uh, the scroll is, I guess. Oh, oh, what? Okay. Uh, I'm gonna get the flashback tape separately because that was really hard. Okay, so I'm gonna do everything but that and then come back into the level and do it that way. Cause yeah, that, that's, that's tough for sure. Definitely did it, yeah. Um, so this works like the ice physics in, in the snow levels. You just keep going. I was expecting to fall down, uh, which did not happen, like, at all. My momentum kept going and never stopped. That was, uh, that was very jarring, compared to what I was expecting. It's not a problem, it's, it's unfortunate circum- Jesus! Unfortunate circumstance, but, uh, but it is what it is. Oh my god, the music's so good. I've, uh, I've noticed that sometimes the top box on the ones that take five to break sometimes breaks in one. I guess it's because like crashes phasing through it five times in like a frame or something. Or in as many frames or something to that effect. So yeah, I'm certain at some point that is going to kill me. <laughs> Don't know when, but just at some point. Oh, ah, this is impossible. <laughs> what the hell is this? I do not understand how this works. Thankfully, assuming the flashback tape is not here, I never have to do this again on the playback. So we'll be okay. But yeah, this is like, this is my Achilles heel right here. I don't know what it is about it, but it just is. It's really cool though. There we go. Yes! Now I probably have to live. Because I... Flashback tapes you can collect, that might not be the same here. Oh, wah! oh my god! The momentum change! <laughs> I had no way of preparing for that. That was wild! As I say, I do not know if I've still got that or not. 
and the game is not telling me, so I'm going to assume I don't have it and make my way back. Because I didn't have enough fun the previous time. I need to play it again. Ooh. The flashback tape's just gonna be through there, isn't it? <laughs> Probably. Oh my god! Absolutely wild. Oh, it did keep it! Okay. Well, that's good to know. That's good to know. I don't have to do this ever again. But I'm going to try and make it like I always intended. Okay, there we go. So where is the flashback? Oh, I, I wonder if there's like an outline, even if I can't collect it. <laughs> oh, this is cool. Yes, there is. It's just there. Okay, that's not too bad. Oh, this is awesome. Eee! No sneaky box. Okay. Cool. Okay, so we can't get that right now, but that is okay. <laughs> Sorry, I mildly freaked out. Could you tell by the fact I went, <laughs> There were many clues. That was the biggest. Okay, we're good. I feel like the second half of this level was not as hard as the first half. Okay, there we go. Cool, we're good. Holy moly, what? This is such a cool idea. So very scary. Okay, thankfully you belly flop really fast in this game. What an awesome level. That was amazing. Okay, the gem spawned like in the podium, but that's fine. That doesn't matter. <laughs> Whew, that was awesome. Right, we're not done though. I've still got my crystal, which isn't a crystal, but I'm, I'm getting it. In theory, this shouldn't be that hard because I don't need to collect the crates. I just need to make my way there. Like, crate collecting was like one of the hardest bits for like sections, but otherwise generally it wasn't too bad. The hardest bit was the momentum change on that one, on that like slippy section. It was pretty good. Like genuinely, I really love this game. I think it is phenomenal what they've achieved. And I can't wait to see more. Like, I just hope it keeps building. Because you've got something pretty special here. And you can absolutely form an, a new legacy. Like, this is this is a new benchmark for fan games at this point. Whether or not it gets taken down. Uh, we'll see. But hopefully not. There's a very real possibility it will, though. Just because of what it is. But hopefully not, because it is amazing. Yeah, that'll do. I don't need crates, so... Haha! -ha! There you go, and the rest is easy. Yeah, the rest of the level is actually super easy. That, that checkpoint honestly probably isn't needed. Okay, he says, jumping into an axe. It's a pendulum of teal. It's a pendulum of doom, come on. <laughs> that was easy, he said. In theory, I should be fine. Here, yeah, there we go. Good job, everyone. Ah, oh, I kind of like it not being, like, flat. Oh, look, it's only two crates. Like, I like it sort of being on an angle. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, there you go. Flashback tapes and Crash Creator. Sweet. Well, let's go to the, uh, to the tapes. Flashback zero. I don't know if these are unique, or if these are based on ones from Crash 4 or not. This seems like kind of similar to one from Crash 4, but I don't think it is the same. I'm gonna get that first, just because I don't trust myself. Ooh, scary. I don't know if hitting this TNT is gonna get that one or not. 
it did not. Okay, good stuff. There we go, that was simple enough. Lovely work. Good old gold. Am I gonna go for gold on all of these? Maybe I should. We'll, we'll see. We'll see, it's not gonna be easy, is it? 64, you say. That was a risk. But a risk worth taking. Oh, this is cool. Uh huh. <laughs> a risk worth taking, immediate death. Okay, this is fine. Ugh, oh, that's hard! Because you have to keep going forward, but like, you kind of just don't want to because it's very easy to overshoot it. Okay, there we go, nice. Yeah, this one gives you leeway. I shouldn't just like, go straight into it because it might be a trick at some point. I think this is, yeah, this is very much like a flashback tape from Crash 4. Because, yeah, it, uh... I don't know if it's identical, but it is... Oh, I nearly blew it. It's very similar. Um, but there you go. Noise! Whew! There's my gold! Alright, let's go. X1. That was pretty straightforward. This has 84, this is less straightforward. <laughs> what are you asking from me here? Okay. Yes, I made the right call. <laughs> At least I think I did. Oh. oh that's scary. Oh my god. I'm gonna hit all these just to get rid of them. I was honestly expecting these to stop. Yeah, I was expecting these to run out of their fives. You know, if you leave them for a bit, they, they just do that. It's worth it. So that should get it. Like, there should be no reason why that's still there. Oh! Ah! Okay, I wasn't sure. I wasn't sure if it was going to get them or not. I thought it might just be far enough away. And that was my bad. I made a bad decision. Alright, well, it happens. It's, it's what it is. At least I know for this time. It's not too difficult. It's just... overwhelming. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I haven't memorized how many of these there are left. I've just... I'm just taking them all out. I'll get that one guaranteed. That will get this one guaranteed. So I need to go. Oh, Jesus! Oh my God! What is this? Ah! <sighs> Intense. <laughs> there we go. Okay, good job. Whew, these are insane, I love it. Okay, two to go. For now. Did I make a mistake? Arguably no. Okay, so. Call of the way there, pretty much. Mildly ominous. Okay, that box fell. Wasn't expecting that, but uh. This is scary. Oh, I see what we're doing. Yeah, I'm getting that afterwards so that I keep it. Which is smart. Oh! Uh, oh my god. Oh, that's hard, man. I can understand why you gave me a checkpoint. Okay. Oh, what have I done? 
Hmm. Yeah, yeah, I knew the mistake I made as soon as I did it. This is, this is really cool, but also very hard. Oh dear. Yeah, I mean, obviously. <laughs> what was I gonna do? being an idiot, go immediately for the TNT. It's not actually that difficult. Like, you're- oh, okay. Your brain is just, like, hardwired in this to, like, avoid the TNT, because that's what you should do. But that's not the puzzle. Oh, no. Ooh, oh, I thought I might just get away with it. But, uh, no, no I did not. Excellent. That should have got them all. Yes, it did. Yeah, I see the puzzle here. It's not that difficult. Okay, come on. We're so close. Oh, we did it, yes! <laughs> oh man, one to go. That is not easy. But it's also not nearly as hard as the hardest ones in Crash 4, so we're okay. Okay, that's a lot. Right. 164, let's go. I wouldn't be sad if there were rows of, like, nitros or something. Yeah, I see what we're doing here. Oh, yeah, no, I was joking, but absolutely that's what we got here. Oh, that was very satisfying. Okay, yeah, before I do this, let me see what I'm up against. Oh, wait a minute. Okay. Now. Oh, I've made a mistake. I made a terrible, terrible mistake. Oh, I freaked out. <laughs> Okay, this isn't as bad as it I thought it was gonna be. Yeah, no, this is very cool. I like this a lot. But uh, it does explain the 164 boxes thing. Yeah, the scariest part about that is actually making sure you definitely get them. Because I wasn't certain. So you want to go for this. Okay, that's, I was going to say, it's not going to explode that, right? The answer is no, it is not. Definitely nothing to my left. No, there is not. Let's say, what's the gimmick here? That might have been a mistake. It wasn't, though. <laughs> God, he dropped like a rock there. It's pretty good. Yes, there you go, that's all of them, right? Yeah, it is! Woo! <laughs> this game is amazing. Let's go! That's all the flashback tapes! Yeah, there you go, all of them done. I will do the Crash Creator later. We got some Uka Uka trials to do. We did the first one, and we got four others, which I suspect will get increasingly cha more challenging. So that's fun. Oh, man, okay. Holy moly, okay. <laughs> is it actually...? No, oh, so it is. I genuinely- I just wanted to experiment. I genuinely thought that I was, uh... Oh, Christ. The right height for that, to go under it. But, uh, no, okay. Oh man, this is tough. This is immediately really, really tough. What's the play here?
that. That's the play, I think. Jeez. That is wild. Oh, whoops. Well, it works. <laughs> that is awesome! Oh, you get 18 seconds. Oh, that was easy. Man, I saw it, like, ahead of time. Like, but man. I was like, that's gonna be super hard. And I think it is. I think I got very lucky. Oh, man, that first jump. Okay, so you need to get rid of the nitro somehow. What? No. Oh, my God, this is wild. I think I know what to do, but... Not 100% sure. What? No, what? No. No, I do not know. That works? Oh my gosh. That's insane. That doesn't look like you can make it. Okay. That's brilliant. That is absolutely brilliant. That's really annoying. <laughs> I've noticed while playing this, I've been increasingly, uh, like, holding the jump button down harder with each- Oh, man! What in the hell do you do there? I have got actually no idea. If I can, like, glitch through the nitros, I won't be disappointed. <laughs> yeah, that doesn't really help, though. I don't think. I don't think it helps, at least. What do you want from me? I don't really know. Do not know. I, I'm. This is really interesting, but I do not understand what it wants for me. I think there's a time where you have to just start to give up because I, I, I've been trying this for quite a while now, and I cannot in any way, shape, or form tell if I'm getting closer to the answer. What I'm attempting here... Oh! <laughs> might be impossible. And that's kind of what I was trying to do, except with Uka Uka instead of belly flopping. Uh, where it like, Uka Uka cancels out your momentum so that I can move forward more. But like, the timing is so strict. It's a fascinating, like, level design. And I would not be surprised if this is actually the hardest of the Akuka stages. <laughs> but it is very, very cool. I'll give it three more attempts, and by that I mean three attempts of me crossing this first gap, because that's a bit insulting. Um, because yeah, I really like these stages, but uh, they might be a bit too much for me. Yeah, because like... <sighs> The thing is, Uka Uka gives you momentum upwards anyway. But you need... In my mind, you need it to be as soon as you hit... The... The... Bounce... Uh... Crate. It needs to be as soon as you hit the bounce crate so that it cancels your upward momentum immediately and replaces, and replaces it with this one. Which I think... I can't test it without just nailing it. I think it will be just low enough to not kill me. But I don't know for sure. Like, this is what I'm assuming I have to do. It might be wrong. <laughs> At what point do you give up because you don't know if you're trying something that's literally impossible? Obviously, the puzzle's not impossible, which is what I'm attempting, maybe. Yeah, I'm gonna try number four. That was really hard. There's no... Am I missing something? Oh, yeah. 
Am, am I missing something? Yeah, Uka Uka. Yeah. It's... I don't know what happened. <laughs> I died suddenly. I'm not 100% sure how. I will take this. But I have a suspicion that's the trick, right? Okay. I think I want to take Aku Aku. I think, and I could be wrong, I think Aku Aku is going to cancel out Uka Uka. But I think at the same time, there is a very real possibility that... Ah, uh, oh, what? No. There's a very real possibility that Fuyuku Aku Akus might kill me. Or it might not. I don't know. Depends on how this level structured. Yeah, that, that crit glitch is very disappointing. Every single time. I mean, I know what to do here, because the idea is simply get Uku to come back, right? Like, it's it's actually pretty straightforward. As as a level... Yeah, that's really annoying. Uh, as a level, this actually isn't that difficult. Comparatively. Okay, so I guess you want to get hit, because you want to get an Aku Aku so you can make it. I guess that's the, the trick. Oh no, have I blown it? Maybe. Ah, go! Please be 19... Oh, it was 30? Oh, that was easy. There's a 90 second timer? You think someone's gonna take 90 seconds to get back? <laughs> okay. Right, what do we got here? Come on, bring it on. Go. Can't be that hard, right? Oh, interesting. That is interesting. What did I say? Is that the right call? It sure was. Oh, okay. Oh, that's awesome. That was awesome. Five seconds. Sorry, what? What? What do you mean? What? How's that even possible? No, that's not possible. No, that's not possible. I'm not... Do want that, don't you? Fantastic. Fascinating. But even then, like, that's got to be a mistake. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say there's meant to be an extra ten seconds added on to anything that it says there, and that makes it doable. Unless there's like, like, because I've worked out a way to do this efficiently. Oh, that was stupid. Yeah, like that's. I lost a tiny bit of time, but. That right there is impossible, unless there is some magical, like, 20 seconds to the left that I don't know about. There is not. That is not possible. <laughs> like, that's a mistake. It has to be. That has to be a mistake. I'm saying that I did it. So I got everything apart from this because I don't understand what I've done. I don't understand what it wants from me. Like, I don't believe it's impossible. I know for a fact this is doable, but I just don't know how to do it myself, if that makes sense. 
I can't wait for the game to tell me that it's like, oh yeah, you you need a thousand seconds. Um, no, you you need to do it in, within four seconds. Like, uh huh, uh huh, that's not possible. Yeah, like five seconds on the previous one. Like I found ways to make that fast, but there is no way that's possible in five seconds unless there is some kind of trick that I do not know about. There's not a way to... Huh. Okay, wait a minute. In the original PS1, there is actually a glitch where you can cancel out the, the bounce of this by spinning on the right frame. <gasps> what? That's ridiculous. No! Okay, okay. Cool, I've worked you out. Okay, great. We're doing this. We're doing this. We're doing this. I mean, I've just got to perform this frame perfect input again, but sure, whatever, we're doing this. Okay, actually, it's not that frame perfect as it turns out. I'll take it. Yay! Yay! <laughs> Alright, there we go. I did them all. I'm saying I did them all. I technically didn't do this, but I think that's because you're a cheater, Kuka. <laughs> so there you go. That is everything in this game. Um, that's all the levels, all the flashback tapes, apart from the Crash Creator. That's right, there is. Oh, welcome! Welcome to Crash Creator! Here you can make sidearm levels in the style of the bonus rounds and flashback tapes. If you don't know where to begin, there are lots of levels included for you to load and enjoy. Try modifying an existing level and have fun with it. Sweet! So can you upload them? I don't know. Um... So you've got, like, background, I guess. Um... Um... Okay, so these are your boxes, which is cool. Here's a crate. Here's an Akraku. Um, oh, this is super cool. Oh, you can have the Yukuka ones. That's nice. That's good. Um, so you can also erase that if you want. Oh, that looked great. Sorry, give me a sec. Oh, and you can also do that. That's really satisfying. Oh, cool. You can change the background. Oh, that's neat. That's really cool. Okay, so you can also uh, use created. Oh, okay, editor levels. Oh, there's actually quite a few. Intense flashback. Uh, sure, let's play it. Oh, huh. Oh man, yeah, this is intense. Like, how do you make? How do you go all the way right? But yeah, no, this is amazing. I really like this, and I really, really hope that this is not the last we've seen of this. Because, yeah, I, w I just want to see more. Loads, loads more. But, yeah, just... It's so brilliant. Yeah, Crush Creator. Oh, User Crits. It's Pico. So there's also... Cal is level... Oh, man, what is this? Hmm. <laughs> Yes, I don't don't think I haven't noticed the huge pit of nitros below me. Thankfully, this isn't that hard so far. I'm going to assume that oh, I don't know where the okay, I was gonna say I don't know where the nitros end. Ah, oh man. I was gonna say, yeah, like, I know that at some point that I need to jump down, but I don't know where, like, the nitros end and land begins. But, uh, it wasn't that at all. Oh, man, that's actually surprisingly difficult. But, yeah, no, this is, this is just really cool. This is just really, really cool. And if I resume and go to edit, yeah, I can go there. And go to user career, but it's also getting cold. 
play getting cold. Oh, sweet. Like, this is just awesome. Like, how could you not love this? It's a freaking, it's, it's like Mario Maker, except it's Crash, and that's all we really want. So, hell yeah. Brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. I like the, the, the two nitros in there, but I presume we will be able to get out uh, via a, a nitro crate at the end of the level. But if not, well. <laughs> so yeah, I can't tell if this is like someone's created level or if this is just included. So I don't know if you can upload levels. Yeah! Nice. That might have been a mistake. That was a mistake. Anyway, uh, if I go to warp room, I want to check one more thing, because it said, yeah, it said user levels, right? User creator tapes. Is that... Right, that's just these. I wasn't sure if you can import. Okay, so you can import, like, if you can, you can, maybe you can upload your file and download them, so there might be, like, a Discord for it. That's cool. Well, this has been an absolute treat. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed it. I absolutely have. It is amazing, an amazing fan game, and I cannot wait to see this evolve, and I'm definitely going to play more if levels get released, and if, if user levels can be uploaded and stuff, I'm all for it. But yes, Thank you very much for watching, I'll leave a link in the description to uh, the channel and to, to uh, Daniel's channel and to download it and all that stuff. And uh, if you've enjoyed this, I very much appreciate it if you would leave a like and subscribe! Share the video around! I'm gonna be covering Crash Team Rumble's beta and I'm very excited for it, so I will see you then! Take care, bye bye.